Hello, this is Monica from Add a Little Dazzle, and in today's edition of Metal 101, we are going to teach you how to cut your craft metal sheets using a paper cutter, so stay tuned. One of the most frequent email questions that we receive is, how do I cut a metal sheet? First of all, I want to explain that our metal sheet is 38 gauge. It is 10 times thicker than aluminum foil, but it is not so thick that you're not able to cut it. And so when we're talking about gauges, the lower the number is, the thicker the metal is, and the higher the number is, the thinner the metal is. So this is 38 gauge. All our craft metal sheets come with one color on the side. This is lovely lavender and on the other side is aluminum. So if you ever want to use aluminum, you could just use the back side of your colored metal sheet. So here I am using the stamping trimmer from Stamping Up, and this paper cutter comes with the cutting blade and it comes with the scoring tool. The way that you can differentiate it is, is that when you are scoring, you want to have a lighter touch, and this is lighter, and when you want to cut you use this one which is darker. So I'm going to line up my craft metal sheet at three inches and I'm going to take my scoring blade and I'm going to go up and down across the metal. And what this does is, is that it softens the metal so that when I come with my cutting blade it will give me a smooth cut and it won't be so difficult to do it and I won't have perforated edges. So now that I've done that I'm going to take my blade and just go straight across. It's going to be a little bit of a harder cut than it would with the cardstock, but it's nothing that's going to damage your blades. I've received questions on whether my blades get dull after doing this, and no, they I don't see that they have any more than they would from just normal use of cardstock. And I don't change out this blade for my metal sheet and have a different one for cardstock. I use the same thing for everything and I just keep a pack of blades just in case it gets dull because you know what always happens is it gets dull at the um, most inopportune moment and so I always make sure that I keep three or four of them handy. So. This is um, how to cut metal sheets, very easy. And make sure to visit our blog at www.adalittledazzle.com for daily inspiration. Sign up for our newsletter and for our feed so you can stay up to date with everything that we are doing. If you have any questions, please feel free to email me at monica at adalittledazzle.com. Thanks and have a dazzling day.